What's up, everybody? It is a Blue Drake, and today I want to show you a game that went completely under my radar. You can stay silent no longer. The government has yet to make an official statement, but nonetheless, we must say it clearly. The world as we know it perished today. In their desperation, the Nazis unleashed nuclear weapons on their homeland and Poland, which has been under occupation for the last 20 years. We suspect that most of the soldiers on both fronts have perished. Only time will reveal the scale of the damage and the next steps of the Third Reich. Once again, we have seen the enemy is prepared to push humanity to the brink of no return. Reports from the continent paint a grim picture. We pray for our soldiers who have fallen fighting evil. We pray for the Polish people who have suffered enough under the yoke of the Nazi terror, persecuted and decimated for two decades. We pray for those who have survived. May they find the strength to persevere and prove that life can overcome death, even in a barren radioactive desert. We do not know what tomorrow may bring, but we must believe that there is still a hope for humanity. We promise that we would be here for you until the very end, serving truth and our ideas. May the Lord watch over us all. Welcome to Paradise Lost. Now, this is a project that I haven't seen. It was announced a couple of months ago, but I guess it's not getting the amount of attention that it really deserves. This is a game that's going to be coming out on Steam in 2021, and it is a fictional game based in a world where the Germans ended up firing nukes at, I guess, the rest of the world. I mean, there's still a lot of unknown factors here because the game's not out yet. We don't know the entire story, but it is set in 1980 following a completely different timeline after World War II. And you play as a boy who actually finds an abandoned German bunker in this uh, assumingly nuclear winter. So you have this, this extreme environment and you are a boy that is hiding out from this nuclear winter and you're unraveling this crazy story of what happened in this underground bunker. And this is a game that looks beautiful. It looks absolutely beautiful. And it has a really interesting story, and I really think that this is something that a lot more people should be paying attention to. Oh, look at that. That's awesome. Wow. So, right now, there isn't too much information, but let me read through what I have. It says, you play as... I, I don't know if I'm saying this right. Sizimon? S-Z-Y-M-O-N. You're playing as Sizimon, a 12-year-old boy who's just discovered a massive... Uh, a massive German bunker following his mother's death. So, your mother has died in this post-apocalyptic world and you find this this bunker and there's actually gameplay from this as well uh, so this is not just a bunch of pre-rendered footage there is actually a gameplay trailer that recently came out don't freak out i just want to talk what is who's that So, basically, I need your help. I'm not going to help you. I don't know you. I've been watching you, so technically I'm not a stranger. I won't let you go unless you promise to help me. Dark the night, the new day sun will rise. I'm scared of the dark too. So, 
So this is a project that I'm, I'm really excited about. I mean, it's it's atmospheric. It is absolutely gorgeous. Uh, and it's it's got a really interesting story that I think is actually pretty uh, pretty pretty interesting. Like this is this is the kind this is kind of almost reminds me of like Metro 2033 or something in that that genre. And I love that stuff. Uh, I love those kinds of games, and I think that if this is a kind of game that, that takes inspiration from those projects, but kind of wraps it in a completely new narrative, I think I'm 100% on board with that. And the gameplay really does look, uh, it really does look amazing. So, I mean, for instance, like, just looking at some of these, these shots, I mean, full screen this here, look at this. Go to some of the environments. It kind of reminds me of uh, almost like when you're, like it's it's like, it's almost like a story from a bunker in Fallout. That looks amazing. It's just dripping. This shot especially right here. This is interesting. It's almost like nature has overtaken this massive German bunker, and you're just exploring it. I don't know. That that's really cool to me. And there's there's so much. I mean, look. Oh wow, that's incredible. The screenshots from the game looks really good. Loving it. So this is a project called Paradise Lost, and if you want to check it out, it's on Steam. You can wishlist it there. It's going to be coming out in 2021. We don't know exactly when the release date is, but it is going to be coming out this year. Looks really beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous looking game. So definitely go check this out. I think this is definitely something that deserves to be on your radar and besides that if you want to keep track of all of these crazy awesome games that are being announced make sure you press that sub button and i'll see you in the next video all right take care ladies and gentlemen remember as always blue drink loves you cheers <laughs>